was good bt gang we back with another very magic see we got dark matter the kimmy matumbo right here before us but before we get to him we're officially on the road to 2000 subs man and the only way we're gonna get there is if y'all keep hitting that like and subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you know every time your boy goes live or post i appreciate y'all so so much and thank y'all in advance but we got this dark matter the kimmy matumbo right here before us you know, he's a 1,000 tokens, so hopefully he's worth that hefty price. We got a 99 offense, 99 defense, 7-2, 250 pounds from Georgetown. We got an 89 driving layup with a 94 post fade, 94 post hook, and 95 post control. 88 mid-range is pretty decent with an 85 three-pointer is pretty good. 95 driving dunk, 95 standing dunk. It's only a 69 ball handle, so he's probably not going to be out here doing too many dribble saves or animations. But we got a 98 block, 58 steals, kind of, and 90 perimeter defense with a 97 interior defense. We got 97 rebounder down the line, 87 speed, 80 speed with ball, 87 acceleration with a 95 vertical, 97 strength, and 90 lateral quickness, man. This dude looks like he's going to be insane, especially on paper. Let's take a look at the badges, man. 27 hops, catch and shoot, corner specialist, brick wall, post paint technician, drop stepper, put back balls, rim protector, chase down artist, box, clamps, defensive leader, interceptor, intimidator, hook specialist, posterizer, rebound chaser, pogo stick, post lockdown, talus defender, worm, back down punisher, downhill, dream shake, set shooter, quick first step, menace, and hustler. And then we got 22 golds. Phyllis finisher, lob city finisher, glue hands, pickpocket, pick dodger, rise up, pro touch, bailout, needle threader, sniper, green machine, hot zone hunter, unstrippable, mouse in the house, bullet passer, ankle braces, grace under pressure, volume shooter, fast twitch, post playmaker, and ball stripper. As you can see, he doesn't come with that gold limitless spot up. But other than that, man, this dude looks like he has it all. He's looked like he's up there stat-wise with Kareem and Shaq and all those guys. So, you know, I love to see that. But let's go ahead and take him out here. He does have high zones in the corner. And I believe he has set shots 17 on very quick. Y'all can quote me down below if I'm wrong. You know what I'm saying? But I believe that's what it is. And I think it's pretty, pretty nice in my opinion. If y'all remember that diamond glitch of the Kimbe from early in the year, he was one of the best bigs in the game for a long, long time just due to the fact that he can shoot at a high clip and block shots and rebound with the best of them. So this card should be no different, man. I'm really, really liking the Kimbe so far, especially seeing this release. But that's going to hit another one right here. Yeah, he has a 95 driving dunk too. So he should be able to get on that rim with ease, man. Not standing dunk. I'm just bad at standing dunks with the stick. But I'll get the idea, man. Let's go ahead and check out the uh, full court six, my man Dikembe. He's not going to be the best dribbling wise, like I said before, man. So if you're looking for a dribbling center, he's probably not going to be that guy. But that's not what Dikembe's here for, man. Like I said before, he's going to hit shots. He's going to rebound. He's going to block shots. He's going to defend at a high, high level, especially with the X, the X switch being the meta right now. You need your big man to be able to guard the perimeter. I feel like that's what Artis Gilmore does so well. And the Dikembe's probably going to be no different. But let's go into Green War 3. With Dikembe, we're going to get to the gameplay. Green light. Okay. Luca, Sabonis, and uh, Scotty Pippen. I almost say Kareem, but this should be a good game. This dude obviously knows what he's doing if he got Luca out here. So, but even if he don't know what he's doing, he has Luca. So, just stay in front. Of, all we gotta do is stay in front of Luca, man. So far, so good. He's not calling for any stream, so it's gonna be an ISO ball, I think. But hopefully, John Morant. John's not the biggest dude, so look at the Kimbe. Nice contest right there, perfect. But we did give up the three right there. We had to get that board. That's tough. <laughs> I tried to get the board with Vince Carter, left my guy open on the backside. That's tough. Okay, it's a bonus. But yeah, the Kimbe is not going to be out here moving, y'all. That's not his job. But he is, he got some decent speed on him. Look at that board. Nice board right there. Big boards. Oh, he got him in the paint. It's a bonus is a good card. Bro, what are you doing, Vince? What the heck? <laughs> Nobody's even coming down the middle. You literally sunk. Why am I corner dropping like that? Excuse me. We're good. We're good. The Kimmy, get out. Oh, my goodness, y'all. Oh, my goodness. Look at that three ball. I'm telling you, bro, especially in them corners. Oh, my God. He's going to be hitting that high clip. You got nothing to worry about. With them high zones, that Hall of Fame corner specialist, you have nothing to worry about. I had to contest. I had to. It's, just, it's tough playing against Luka, man. Luka opens up so much. We still... Ja, get that rebound, please. Ah, that would have been a huge board, man. It's kind of tough out here running with Ja. I'm not going to lie. He is only 6'3". And we probably not even going against anybody that's like 6'5 or under, you know, nowadays. And it kind of hard. It kind of makes him hard to guard Ja. I mean, Luka on defense. That's a, oh, that's a good contest, Ja. It's, it could have been... It should have been better, but I'll take it. We just turned the ball over. GG's. Oh, my God. Imagine getting cooked by Luka in a gameplay, bro. It, Luka's just so crazy. It's nothing you can do. Sabonis. 
I don't think he has the speed to keep up with us. That's a good block. Come on, bro. That's all, though. We good. Luca, that's all. That should be off. Yes, sir. We good. We out. We're out. All right, VC. There we go. All right, let's get going, bro. Let's get going. I wish I could put Vince. We might got to run Vince at the PG from now on. Because uh, Josh's too small. Vince is doing a good job here. Josh's too small for Scotty, too. That's the only thing. Oh, my. Okay. We'll take that. We'll take that, BT game. We'll take that. We'll take that. Come on, Dikembe. He got that quick first step. Dikembe has that quick first step, man. Don't forget about that. I forgot about that myself. You see, he got a nice little burst there. I believe it. I don't know what his dribble style is, but that quick first step is a huge bonus, for, especially for a center out here. Going against a big dude likes a bonus. You want to be able to take those guys off the dribble as much as possible. We're here. Yeah, we got Hall of Fame clamps. Yep, yep, perfect. No. We just can't get rebounds. We're too small. We're just too... Hey, there you go, the can they get it? Ah, uh, we got to get that rebound. We got to get that board. We're fine, let's keep it going. Yeah, Josh kind of holding his back in this gameplay. It's fine, though. Quick first step. Jump. Nice little leg right there. Perfect pay match right there from the Kimbe. He's good, man. I'm telling y'all, he's good. It's just the fact that we're going against Luka right now with John Morant. Not really ideal. <laughs> as far as him doing his job, he's doing his job, man. He's doing his job. Josh is getting cooked. There's <laughs> nothing we can do about that. Josh is being cooked right here. Little paint match. There you go, Dikembe. Doing his thing, bro. All you got to do is paint match a little bit. I mean, that's 2K22 in a nutshell, man. If you're not paint matching, what are you out here doing? Honestly. Come on, Ja. Nice little board from VC. Oh, yeah, Dikembe. Shoot. Simone is not... Look at that jump shot. It's not the prettiest thing, but I'm telling you. I was really, really green in my opinion. Dang, look. He just messing up my gameplay today, huh? I'm gonna just keep VC at the point guard. You got it. That's what we're gonna have to do. We're there. Perfect. Luca, Luca, Luca. Oh, yeah, the Kimbe. Nice little. Look at that Intimidator coming in for the Kimbe right there. I know you're gonna kick it out. The Kimbe with a nice Intimidator play right there. Can we, let's just switch. Just switch. Just switch. Just switch. There we go. Per oh, my God. Luca is just crazy. Luca's crazy, y'all. Like, he's literally running his. He's single handedly. It's destroying me right here, but another bucket for the Kimmy right there. What kind of take does he have? He has a rebound and take. I would expect glass. I mean, paint protecting take, but it is what it is. The Kimmy had a good test because obviously he wasn't there for the board. Perfect over. Ah, there's nothing we can do, man. GG to my opponent, man. He kind of had a big Sabonis down low. But I'm telling y'all, Matumbo is really, really good in my opinion, man. He hit his threes. He got a, he got a couple of rebounds when he could. He couldn't get all of them you know, due to the fact that he was switching with John Morant. But I'm telling y'all, man, this dude is definitely worth a 1,000 tokens in my opinion. But if y'all enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. I ain't going to say nothing more. I ain't going to say nothing less. Y'all stay blessed. Peace.